See ya. Later. What is going on guys, Danny Gets Fit here and welcome to another full day of bulking. So pretty much every Sunday now I vlog do a full day of bulking and then upload it on Monday. So this is the day you're watching it, Monday. And uh, today the kind of food that we're getting is Chinese food. but. It's pretty much all I'm eating today. I ate way too much yesterday. I'm pretty much deciding to eat just like one big meal and then a lot of protein later because I did cook a bunch of chicken breast up last night. So pretty much I'm gonna be sticking close to what normal calories I should be eating, but probably just like a little bit less just to compensate for yesterday, going a little bit over. So we're going to there. Um, it is called Walkbox. Um, they actually reached out to me and gave me a couple gift cards for there because um, they have great food. It's you're able to track it and it has decent macros and it's delicious because it's Chinese food and everyone likes Chinese food. So we're gonna be heading there to Kelowna and then we're also getting some costume stuff because next weekend or I guess it's this weekend now because this yeah no is it still this weekend? Next weekend? Two weeks? In two weeks, we're going to um, the Fan Expo in Vancouver, which is essentially like a little Comic-Con. Um, it's the closest thing to a Comic-Con that we have around here. And uh, there's gonna be some special guests there. And so we're gonna be dressing up and looking all cool. It's gonna be fun. She's going as... Lara Croft. Tomb Raider. And then I'm gonna go as either Nathan Drake from Uncharted or Negan. But then I have to find a baseball bat with barbed wire. For those who watch Walking Dead. Oh my God! That episode. <laughs> Anyways, let's head to Cologne. I, I, I ripped like two, I ripped two holes in my jeans, like right, right where the knees are. Man, come on. Fashion. <laughs> yeah. Thank we'll you. see you up here, thank you. We gotta make a quick stop for babe to get Starbucks. Oh, I'm so hungry. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Made it to walk box. I'm so hungry. It's not even funny. So we're gonna get some food. Yeah. In a second here, you'll see what I got, but essentially it's a clean sour chicken with rice. I added some broccoli in for some micronutrients. And then she's got raw veggies here that I might steal from her that I haven't told her about yet. But I might put some of that in. And then sriracha. Hi, cheers. Babe got Kung Pao. Mm -hmm. I got Kung Po. Sweet and sour. <laughs> Kung Pao. Not Kung Po. Kung Po. <laughs> I got sweet and sour chicken, rice, broccoli. Feed me. Yeah, that. Do it. No. Do it. No. Do it. It's on camera. You gotta do it. Is that good, babe? Yeah. Is good? Yeah. What? Almost walked into the car. <laughs> Make sure you're always watching where you're going, silly. I'm clumsy, you know this. It's true. I think the first time, like the first week or so we started dating, you like went to like jump on the bed and then like fell over off of the bed. Yeah. I laughed. <laughs> It's like, what are you doing? You're like, I don't know. And you just like laid on the floor. Oh, I definitely remember <laughs> that. That was. You're like, no, I'm fine. I think I hit my knee pretty bad. <laughs> so just got here to the gym. Today we have a high volume, lower strength day. So we're gonna start off with squats. And what else do I have? I gotta check. So we're gonna be starting off with squats and then we got deadlifts, front squats, leg extension, super set of lying leg curl plank and then hang, hanging leg raise for the core and abs. So that's what I'm going to be doing today. Going to take <clears throat> you through the first few, going to take you through the first few sets, see how I feel, let you know, you know, weaknesses I'm working on, stuff that maybe you can help to work on, some weaknesses you may have. Anyways, 
let's get started. So just gonna do a couple warm up sets to get things started, to get warmed up. Um, it takes me a bit to warm up because my hips are really tight usually. So I did some mobility work to start off. Now usually what I do is I start with the bar and a 25 per side and then I go from 25 to 45 and do a couple reps and then move into the working sets. So let's do that first. So that's the last set of warm up, feeling good. Now we're gonna go into the first working set. First working set, I'm supposed to do one set of a weight that I can do for three reps, but I'm only doing one rep. Um, so I'm gonna do 205. I think I should be able to get it for one rep for sure. Um, we'll see how that feels. First set of three by five. So the last set here with 175, so I've dropped it 10 pounds. I'm gonna do as many reps as possible. Um, I have a feeling since I got 185 for five reps for three sets, I'm gonna be able to get probably around eight reps with 175. We'll see. I'm confident. Oh, it's the first day of higher volume and I'm feeling it. I think that was seven reps. I wanted to get eight, but I felt my back coming to play a lot on that last rep. Probably wasn't very clean. But anyways, so now we're moving on to deadlifts and then front squats afterwards. Man, my legs are gonna be tanked today. The last set I felt my back be a little bit rounded so I can really focus on that for this next set. Dropped it down 10 pounds. We'll see how this goes. I'm having a harder time getting lower today than usual. So what I'm gonna do is take off these squat shoes I have on and uh, go barefoot. Um, usually I have some flat shoes that I use, um, but right now I don't wanna like change shoes back and forth for every different exercise. So I'm just gonna switch it up, see if that allows me to get a little bit lower. You'd be surprised how much shoes can have a play in when you're doing squats, deadlifts, and that sort of thing. Uh, a lot of people I see squat in like running shoes and the soles of those shoes are so 
squishy and immobile that, um, sorry, I mean mobile, um, so your foot moves around a lot, that they can actually impact your, the amount of weight you can lift by a lot. You'd be surprised. So if you're doing deadlifts or squats and you just can't seem to get lower, you can't seem to get a good push off the ground, try changing up the shoes. Squat shoes can be great for sh uh, squats and then flat like Converse or Vans for um, deadlifts work wonders. Okay, so now I'm gonna move on to front squats, but I'm not gonna talk anymore because I really wanna focus on the workout the, uh, to end it off really well. So I'm gonna watch these couple clips and then we'll get back to the house and eat some chicken. So we'll see you guys then. Just cooking up some chicken I made the other night. It's currently warming up in the microwave. Just uh, hitting the rest of my protein for the day because we had a lot of carbs in the rice of the wok box food that I had earlier. And then I also had before the gym two Arby's sandwiches. Surprisingly, Arby's has pretty good macros. It was like 30 carb, 10 fat, and like 20 protein for a little sandwich. So I got two of those. And then this will pretty much cap off my calories and macros for the day. So actually, for once um, in these videos, we actually hit my macros pretty well on so yeah after this i'm pretty much gonna close this video out and uh hang out with joel he hasn't been in the vlog for a while but back a little bit ago we made a video um, on circuit training and uh how you can do that instead of cardio if you really don't like cardio and yeah so we're just gonna hang out he's been away at work for a while so we will talk to you guys in a bit so the girlfriend's coming over in a bit and uh so i'm gonna cook up a pizza for her and maybe just have like one little slice um, can't go a day of a day of bulking without some pizza but anyways guys I'm just doing some things on my computer because it's been running slow lately so I'm trying to like figure out what I need to do updating some drivers and whatnot to uh, try and fix it um, but I am looking at a new like upgrade but I can't decide if I want to like go desktop so like I have like a home office kind of deal or if I want to get another laptop because when I travel down to the states and have to edit videos on the go I'd like to have something compact that's that's fast because the only problem with my current computer is that it's like 30 pounds and it's like a 20 inch screen so I'm thinking about downgrading to like a 15 inch screen um, but yeah if there's any computer people that watch this video give me some suggestions down below that would help otherwise I'm gonna edit this video off here thanks for watching guys hit the like button if you like the video comment down below of course because I love hearing from you guys and subscribe if you're new to the channel until next time until next time stay swole my friends stay swole Corgi.